Okay, what's up guys? So, during this very serious moment of freaking world history, this coronavirus traveling all over the place, um, I highly encourage you guys to be safe. Um, you know, like, uh, it's because it's, it's just really crazy right now, like, everything that's going on. Like, it's seriously mind-blowing, like, how serious this coronavirus has, like, became. You know, like, there's, like, I was going to, like, go places tomorrow and stuff. And um, overall, like, I mean, yeah, still work on my, uh, like, YouTube stuff. Because for those that didn't know, I don't know, I, I don't think I posted it on social media yet, but... Uh, pretty much my job is going to be shut down. Like the job that I work at downtown Seattle is going to be shut down for the next few weeks. So, uh, yeah, it's, um, it's gotten really serious. It's gotten like very, very serious because the other companies, so I work in this building, I work in a restaurant inside this building and the other companies that like worked in within that building, they all like shut down like their locations and stuff. So, um, overall, like, we knew that that wasn't going to bring in any money for us, so we just decided, like, yeah, we're going to just close the place down until this stuff, like, you know, is, uh, like, gets a little bit better, you know, to where it's, like, we can see, we could go back to our regular day-to-day, -day, um, you know, jobs and stuff, because let me tell you guys, at this job that I work at, like, I'm a cashier, and I'm ringing up, like, probably 500 people a day. I have gotten used to ringing up 500 people a day. I look forward to ringing up 500 people a day. But the last time I had worked there, which was this past Monday, I've only I only rang up maybe less than 20 people. That was it. And it's crazy. It's like and I think that day we only made like maybe 20 to 30 dollars because there's people they were coming in there just getting a dollar coffee and things um but yeah it was uh it was crazy it was just really wild like working and usually at like noon there's so many people in there so many people in there i'll never forget the one day where i was the only cashier out there we were slam busy everybody was all over the place i had like probably 30 to 40 people in my line maybe like close, like uh, probably a little over 30 people. It got to the point because my the cafe, it's like big, but my line was like going around the whole cafe pretty much. So yeah, it I went from that to ringing up like one person and then doing like numerous laps around the cafe trying to find stuff to clean and do. But it was just like, man, it was just so wild, like, seeing that and things. Like, I have a picture of, um, I took and stuff. I think I'll probably post it on social media to show y'all, like, how it was and things. Um, but yeah, it was, it was just crazy, like, seeing that and stuff. So, I, um, yeah, they, they, um, they sent us home early. Usually, I'm getting off, like, maybe, like, 3, 3.30. I got off, um, on Monday. It's so, like, I think it was, like, that Monday, I was um, pretty much off week, like all of like the last, yeah, all of last week. And then I had worked, uh, it was that um, Thursday. And, Cause yeah, that two weeks ago, it was cool. Like people was going through and stuff, but then it got to like the last two days, especially Friday, there was uh, no, there was nobody there. So we, um, yeah, we overall was like pulling out things, cleaning and stuff and it was just so wild, man. Like, it was wild seeing that. I'm like, then that's, I, it was like, at first, I didn't really think this coronavirus is all that serious. Like, and I was even like coming up with conspiracy theories about, like, oh, this is probably fake. Like, they probably just saying this so people can, like, you know, be a little bit more clean or stopping the crime rate. Like, there's like a lot of stuff that was surrounding it, like, even with the conspiracy theories. But now I'm like seeing how serious it had gotten and stuff to where, like, stores that I go to on a regular basis, they're closed. Like, the Nike store, they closed down. Foot Locker, Champs. Uh, yeah, it was like, it was, it's wild. It's very, very wild. So, that's why I'm like, I'm encouraging everybody, um, be safe, be clean, uh, wash your hands, um, 
you know, to, I guess stay indoors and stuff unless it's like something really serious for you to like for it to, for it to be required for you to go outside and stuff. But um, yeah, be safe. Overall, just be safe. Like it's you know, there's employees that I hadn't even seen in like two, three weeks and stuff. And I'm like, man, like it's wild even like that and stuff. And then what else? It's yeah, it's just a really wild situation. And it was like now I was supposed to go to this uh, like show on uh, the end of the month can't go to that i'm gonna have to wait until it's it's crazy because the show ended up getting up postponed until the day after my birthday and stuff so there's that and then um yeah it's uh it is it is it's wild it's really wild right now so i encourage everybody to be safe be healthy um you know it's like i feel like it's the time and place so it's like really just like be safe you know, but anyways, talk to you guys later. Thank you guys for watching. Um, like and subscribe if you're new to the channel. I'll give you guys more updates about this situation. But uh, yeah, talk to you guys later. Thank you for watching and peace.